Now, for this last part of the question, we're told that the rope will break if the tension exceeds 5 mg. And we've got to explain how this is going to restrict the possible positions of P. In other words, just find out what our range of values of x would have to be. So that means then that if the rope is not to break, that tension T must be less than or equal to 5 mg. And we found out in the first part of the question that T was given by this equation here. So all I've got to do is substitute this result into this inequality here and solve it for x. So if you do make that substitution, this is what you're going to get. I can now divide throughout by 5mg, so we can cancel those out, and then just multiply both sides by the 6a. And doing that, I therefore have the a plus 3x is less than or equal to 6a. Subtract a from both sides, just leaving me with x, 3x, I should say, is less than or equal to 5a. And dividing both sides by 3 now leaves me with x is less than or equal to 5a over 3. And there you have it. So, hope you're able to see your way through that part of the question if that caused any problems. So, thanks for watching, and if you've got any problems, hopefully, you'll keep watching my other videos.